I've been a big fan of quadruped robots, otherwise known as robot dogs, ever since I saw those cute videos from Boston Dynamics featuring their robot dog spot. I dreamed of a future where I could one day own one, but like all dreams, you do have to wake up to reality eventually. Although Spot's high price tag and exclusivity to companies still remains the same, what hasn't remained the same is the amount of competition there is in the world of robotics, whether it be humanoid robots or robot dogs. In the case of robot dogs, the competition is mainly coming from a Chinese company called Unitree Robotics. Well, I guess it's not really competition when their robot dogs are the best in the market. Like Boston Dynamics, Unitree does sell their flagship models for a premium, but they do offer an affordable model called Go2, which I am the proud owner of. The reason I'm making this video is because I was recently recommended a video showcasing the capabilities of Spot, and one part of that video stood out to me. May I try to do things that might cause it to fall down? Um, yeah, you can like go over the rocks and stuff and uh, a little bit of this rubble. Okay, you got it. I can see it looking around at the camera. It thinks it's stuck. Should I help it out? Hey! I'm not trying to make it fall anymore. Sorry! I couldn't help but to ask myself, how would my go-to have done? Well, I decided to try recreating that obstacle course using a bunch of old junk I gathered. I also did a test that I thought would be impossible to pass, but you have to stay to the end of the video for that.